Welcome back to another video. This is Will P and today I have the camera comparison between the iPhone 12 Pro and the OnePlus 8 Pro. You can also check the speed test between these two devices in the channel. Here we have the video recording. I think they both do a very good job, but the iPhone handles the exposure and the shadow details much better, while the 8 Pro captures more details. If you look at the trees or the ground, you can notice the difference in the amounts of detail they both capture. These differences will carry on in the photo shoots as well. For the main camera and during daylights, the iPhone has a better dynamic range and deals quite well with different lighting scenarios. The details in the shadows are less likely to be missed compared to the 8 Pro, but the photos coming out of the 8 Pro are in general sharper and they carry more details. Outdoors, they have very similar performance in most typical scenarios. I think iPhone photos are brighter, but the contrast is sometimes better on the 8 Pro. This is very personal. Some may prefer photos on the iPhone and some on the 8 Pro. I have mixed feelings and depending on the scene, my to-go shooter may change. Let me know what you think and which one do you prefer. I will also do a comparison between the OnePlus 8T and the regular iPhone 12. Make sure you subscribe if you are interested to see more videos like this. About these two cameras, the only thing I'm quite certain of is that the iPhone does better in the dynamic range and handling the exposure and the 8 Pro captures more details. If you look at the photos I took in the shopping mall, the 8 Pro captures the pattern of the ground in a much more detailed way, while the iPhone has smoothened the photo and the details are missing. The situation changed a bit for the ultra wide camera iPhone still has a better dynamic range, but the 8 Pro does better in keeping the shadow details and photo seems to be also sharper. Both doing very similar job in other aspects, photos are noise free and the distortion is very minimal. The telephoto lens follows the same pattern, with OnePlus having 3x zoom, you can have a closer look to the subjects while not losing the quality and 12 Pro offers two times zoom. Again, the 12 Pro does better in dynamic range and colors are more vibrant and the 8 Pro brings more detail to the table. To be honest, after this comparison, I'm quite impressed by the performance of the 8 Pro because it is definitely competing well against the 12 Pro with all those hype around it and is surely not a loser. They compete quite well in daylight shootings, but during night shots, things get quite different. On the main camera, iPhone starts capturing more details and colors are closer and more accurate. While the OnePlus takes very good photos, I think the iPhone does an overall better job on the main camera for nighttime shootings. But for the ultra wide, while the iPhone captures more details, photos are very noisy. I definitely prefer the ultra wide on the 8 Pro for night shootings. And the selfie camera, both for night and daylight, is just better on the 12 Pro. The video recording on the main camera during night follows the same approach, just like photo shootings. On the 12 Pro, contrast and dynamic range is better and the video quality is sharper but the video is a bit brighter on the 8 Pro. The OIS seems to be quite good on both devices, both during day and night. So this was it. I can't call a winner for this camera comparison, but surely these two devices are very good in camera department and mostly it comes to your personal preferences. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and until the next one.